Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the moment you've all been waiting for. How to get all the trophies in Snapchat. Hey, what is going on everybody? Aaron here from Break the Internet. Welcome back to another Snapchat video today on the channel. Now, as the intro says, we're gonna be taking a look at how to get the rest of the Snapchat trophies within Snapchat. This has been a comment that I've been getting basically for the past three or four months, and we're finally making the video today. So just keep in mind today, we're only talking about six or seven of them in this video because I've already made other videos talking about how to get the other ones that we already know of. So I'll go and leave a card right up here on screen. So click that if you wanna go and check out those videos. But without further ado, guys, let's finally get into how to get the rest of the Snapchat trophies here on Snapchat. Alright guys, so moving over to the phone section of today's video, just to let you know, it's going to be a little bit of a longer video, just because I kind of have to explain everything about each of these new trophies, so I'll probably have some timestamps down in the description below, so you can go and just click to the ones that you need to get to, and the ones that you haven't found out already. So let's go and move on over to the phone, I'm going to click my trophies up here, and the first new one that you're going to see is that we have this cool guy right here with the sunglasses. Now, unfortunately, the only way you can get this one is if you have a pair of the Snapchat spectacles. So once you get the spectacles, you're gonna pair them to your device, and then you will then easy enough get this trophy. But like I said, if you don't have the spectacles, then you actually can't get this trophy. Before we get into the next tip, I need to bring you guys into the settings section so we can change a setting to make it a little bit easier for you when you're trying to go for these trophies. So what you're gonna do is when you're in Snapchat, go up to your settings, wherever the settings are, go down to memories, and up here or down at the bottom, when you click save to, make sure it's set to memories and camera roll. What this is gonna do is when you go, let's just say uh, I'm in my Snapchat, right? And I take a picture. When I click this save button down here at the bottom left, it is going to save to my camera roll as well as my memories. And in the memories, we're gonna have to deal with those pictures. I'll explain all that in just a second. So this next trophy is a really good example of why we click save to memories and camera roll. So this next one, like I said, is gonna be send a story from memories. So we're gonna go over to the main section. We're gonna swipe up to our memories. We're gonna go, it should, it would usually be on all, but we're gonna swipe on over to snaps. We're gonna click one of our snaps. We're gonna hold down on it, go up to the top right and click create story from this snap. So once we do this, there's going to be a little red, uh, little red check mark. Go to a different like singular snap. Let's just say I wanted to do this one, and I wanted to do another one of these like crazy eggs. Don't ask. We went on a trip this weekend. I had to make a bunch of eggs for all the people. Anyway, once we have all the selected, we're going to click create a story, and then we're going to click send, and we're going to click send it to somebody. So I'm just going to go ahead and let's just send it to. I'm going to send it to myself just so no one gets any of this crazy story. So Aaron, FPS, break the internet. I'm going to send that. And once you send it, once it successfully sends, you'll then get the little white dot and you'll have that trophy. So the next trophy right next to that is going to be search for a snap in memories. So this one's really easy. All you gotta do is go back, swipe to memories. Up at the top left, you see a little search icon. Let's just say I search um, car, I don't know. Once you search for it and click it, It'll bring up a bunch of different snaps with a car in it. I don't know why it's not really loading, but once you do that, you should have the trophy and you should see the little detective show up in your trophies panel. So this next one is this little disc icon right up here, and this is the different tiers. So the first one is just a little floppy disk. You save 10 snaps to memories. The next one is save 100 snaps to memories. And the last one that I don't have unlocked, it's save 1,000 snaps to memories, which I believe is like a DVD disk. And that's why we, in settings, that's why we set it to save to camera roll and to memories, because all you gotta do is go to your uh, camera or whatever, take a picture, click save, and once you do that, it'll save it to the camera roll and memories, and then you unlock the trophy. Just do that 10, 100, or 1,000 times to unlock each tier. So the next trophy is this little blue icon, which has created a story in memories, which we kind of did for the first step of the white one. So if you're going for the white one, you'll already automatically get the blue and the white together. But if you're just skipping directly to this trophy or to this, I guess, part of the video, all you have to do is swipe up to your memories, go up to your snaps, click one of the pictures, go hold down on it, go to the top right, click create a story from snap, click another snap to create a story. Once you click create a story and go back into your memory set or go back into your trophy section, it should have the blue dot unlocked. Next, I don't really know what to call this, but it looks like a CD in a CD case or kind of like a record player. I don't really know, but this is to save a story into memory. So rather than saving just a regular snap into memories, you're going to save the entire story. So right now I believe I have a story up of like the lunar eclipse. Um, so, I just have a couple snaps in here. Instead of just clicking one of them and clicking save, you're gonna to wanna to go up to my story up here, click this one, 
And once you do that, when you make sure that you have the setting that we talked about earlier, setting um, to save to camera roll and to your memories, that should be good. And when you go back to it, you should have it unlocked. Next trophy on the list is going to be to set up my eyes only in memory. So my eyes only basically is a section in Snapchat where you can put snaps that you don't want other people to see. I'm not telling you what to put in there, but just know that someone else won't be able to look at it. So when you, what, what you want to do here is go over, swipe up to memories once again. And originally you'll probably be in all and then you swipe all the way over to my eyes only. If you haven't set it up yet, then all you have to do is on screen, it should say like create a passcode for my eyes only, um, confirm that passcode, and it might tell you to put in like an email or something like that in case you forget the password so you can reset that. So like I said, not saying what to put in there and what not to put in there, but just make sure that um, you remember that passcode. And you might be telling yourself, those aren't all the trophies, you're missing a couple on there. Well, that's completely true, and here's why. So at the bottom down here, you see that I still have three trophies that aren't unlocked. The first one is one that came out a long time ago, and that's the sun icon that says to take a snap that's over 100 degrees. Honestly, I've never been anywhere this year that's been over 100 degrees or that I've caught this filter, so unfortunately, I haven't been able to get that one. The next trophy on here that I don't have unlocked, unfortunately, is the little world or the little earth icon, and that is to get your snap Snapchat published to a live story. So when you're on Snapchat, you take a snap and you click the send button. Sometimes it says like send to, let's just say a Valentine's story or Mother's Day story. If your Snapchat is gets published in there, then it'll actually give you that world icon. Like I said, I, I guess I'm not good enough to get published on there, but once I do, I'll definitely get you guys updated and send a little picture to let you know that I indeed unlocked the trophy. And the last trophy down here that I don't have unlocked is going to be a TV emoji. Now that is going to be to get your snap posted onto a local story. So when, once again, if you take a Snapchat and you send, and let's say you're in New York or Chicago or wherever you live, it says to post it to the local story, you click that and if it gets published, then you will get that Snapchat trophy. Like I said, I guess I'm not good enough to get posted to local or live stories. So if you do that and you make it on there, definitely send me a screenshot or comment that you have one of those and, and you'll probably hurt my feelings a little bit, but that's how you get all the trophies. And that is gonna do it for today's video, guys. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a big fat like on this video, shows your support and gets this video out to everybody that doesn't know how to get the trophies because like I said, everyone's been asking for like the past six months on how these things are achieved and now we know. Also, leave a comment down below what you think about the video, what you think about the quality in general, and of course, guys, my name is Aaron from Break the Internet, your number one stop shop for Snapchat tips, tricks, updates, and everything you need to know about Snapchat. Of course, guys, enjoy the rest of your day, and we'll see you next time.